All right, today we have the FMS uh, P47D Lightning. It flies on a six cell battery pack. It's a 1500 millimeter wingspan. Everything was screwed together construction. Four on the tail. You have your four wing bolts inside here, so it makes it a real clean uh, construction. Very easy to put together. I'm using a five uh, Admiral six channel receiver with the gyro in it. We'll see how it goes with the gyro. Uh, very pretty plane out the box. Uh, all the details were included. The only things you had to glue on pretty much is the guns. This gun slides off and the bombs had to be glued on. Very pretty spinner. Scale four blade prop. Like I said, this plane flies on a 6S power system. So I'm expecting it to be pretty quick. Uh, very big scale, good details to it, and this will be the maiden flight. I'm using a 5,000 milliamp battery pack from HRB, 60 c discharge. Now the battery comes with this battery tray, very easy to install. You strap it down to the tray and then you come in from the plane right here. Slide it in place. Clips in. Very easy. Let's hook it up. So this could be the end of the flight. Now the canopy don't have a latch. It's got magnets, but it's real tight. Once it's in there, it's not coming out. Flying on 100%, no dual rates. I do have a little bit of dual rates set in place. Uh, didn't mix anything with my flaps yet. I'm not sure what it's going to act like. The flaps are uh, that's half flap, full flaps. So basically, we're going to see what it does on this maiden flight, and we'll make our adjustments from there. I do have it set up to where I can turn the gyro on and off. Stability mode. Gyro. So I'm going to take off without the gyro and I'm going to see what it does once it's in the air. This is a different location that we're flying at. <coughs> I usually fly in my backyard, but we've been having a lot of rain here in Louisiana. Too wet. So I picked this dead end road to come down right across from my house. I'll do a little quick video and see how it does. Expecting it to torque to the left. Hopefully, we can get it straight down the runway. Let's see how it goes. Flies like a typical warbird, very smooth, very fast, very clean flying plane. I guess this gray sky is probably hard to see with that gray, but like I said, we've been having nothing but rain here. I'm going to 
turn around and head into the wind and see what the, what the flaps do. Houses. Time remaining two minutes. Pretty like that. I can see once I'm able to get to our RC field here in Louisiana where I have a lot more room to fly. I'll be able to execute a little bit more. landing area. I guess I gotta practice with that a little bit. All in all it's very good flying plane. Tried to save it on the runway but looks like I knocked off an oil tank. Not a big deal. Just glued right back on. Got the drop tank off. Well, we'll put another battery and try it again. Thank y'all.